Well, it's the long-lasting career promo. It's a luck-based promo. But all I care about is we have finally gotten the elite boost to team that I have been dying for. Paul Pierce with an elite shooting boost to team. We're going to play with Crawford and Pierce. Spoiler alert, they're both buckets. All right, let's cue the intro. Hey guys, what's good? Rising Phoenix One. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. Hey, this video is presented by the EA Creator Network and a big shout out to EA and our community manager, Kits, for getting us the resources that allowed us to go after and ultimately get Jamal Crawford and Paul Pierce. All right, so as I'm sure you know, we've had this promo format before. This is a totally luck-based promo. You start off here, you need to get Parish and Kid in order to open up this event up at the top. And once you get up here, you need to get 94 Jamal Crawford and 89 Vince Carter in order to open up this bottom one here and do one event to claim. 96 Paul Pierce with an elite shooting boosted team, right? Here's our lineup, right? Now, I played that top event 89 times, and in doing so, I drew one Jamal, two Jamal, three Jamal, four Jamal, five Jamal Crawfords, <laughs> until I finally pulled the 89 2% chance card Vince Carter, and that opened it up and allowed us to get Paul Pierce. So let's look at these stats real quick. I think this is my new shooting guard and small forward. Jamal Crawford has a gold plus two shooting boost to position, and that's how he looks. Man, I mean, having this Pierce card really opens up a lot of options. We've still got plus eight to athleticism, plus two to rebounding, plus four to defense and a big plus 15 for Jamal Crawford perimeter shooting. And I love Jamal Crawford cards. I just do. His perimeter shooting, 93, 94. 84 contested is kind of low. 94 touch looks good. Athleticism stats, I mean, it's pretty much for Crawford. He's fast and he's agile. Nice rebounding for a shooting guard. Decent inside offensive game. Really good looking perimeter shooting. 94 on ball. Wow, he's got good defensive stats. 94 on ball, 93 block, 94 steal, 90 hands on perimeter, 94 interception, 90 drawing offensive foul. So when I look at this card, he's fast, he can shoot from the perimeter, and he should be able to play some defense. I'm digging this card. I've used it a few times. He's a bucket. Sorry for the spoiler alert, he's a bucket. And then we get to another bucket, and I'm kind of surprised because I haven't had a lot of luck with Paul Pierce cards, but I've played with him several times, and he just hits his shots. So let's look at his stats. But on the right side, on the far right side, that red square with the crosshairs in it, that tells us this is a plus four shooting boost to team. Athleticism stats are looking pretty good. He's got speed, agility, uh, decent strength. You know, that's pretty much it. Nice rebounding for a small forward, a very good looking inside offensive game, and a pretty dang good looking perimeter shooting game as well. 87 on ball, 84 steal, 86 interception. Not a lot on defense there, but not horrible and then he has um well yeah he has an offensive post game i guess um but i'm not going to be using any of these cards in the post just to get their shot blocked right so that's paul pierce and these are the two guys we're going to be playing with exclusively filling out our lineup 94 steve nash 
97 Dirk and 97 Moses Malone. All right, so having this elite shooting boost, it just opens up some options, right? I don't have to give up on this very nice defensive jersey in order to get just another plus two to perimeter shooting. So yeah, looking pretty good, looking pretty good. And in fact, having Pierce there opens up all kinds of options for your 100 overall lineup. You can have a 100 overall top lineup with LeBron starting, with a 93 LeBron starting. So that's pretty, pretty cool. All right, so without further ado, we're gonna jump into Showdown. We're just gonna play one and see how Jamal and Paul Pierce, the truth, can do. Let's do it. All right, we got a 98 multi-year. It's really not tanked, but I mean, I think that 99 Lowry is gonna be a problem for Nash, we'll see. I will say I've played three or four showdowns this morning in the AI. Uh, geez, it's hitting everything. It's hitting everything. All right, let's win the tip, Moses. All right, Jamal Crawford, deep from the wing. Contested, boom, challenged actually. Nice, a 109 boosted three-pointer. Oh no, get that board, Moses. All right, it's the truth's turn. Paul Pierce, boom, top of the key. Wide open, 105 three-pointer. Let's go, let's go, good start. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Get the ball. Nice, Paul Pierce. Let's get an assist for Pierce. Oop. Nice, Dirk. All right. All right, from here on out, we're just shooting with these guys. You got your little alley-oop there, right? Oh, that's in. That's in. I just think Nash is gonna have trouble with this slowery. Kind of skating backwards over to the wing, but Jamal buries it. So far, nobody's missing. 11 to three. These guys are gonna score. I mean, they're gonna score double digits. That's it, doggone it. Lowry, <laughs> Lowry, come on, man, come on. Let's go, catch and shoot, corner three, Paul Pierce, boom, boom. Those are truth bombs, right? Bombs from the truth, let's go. No, 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 just stay on Lowry. I can't get a steal. Who is that? Senator Bill Bradley? Senator Bill Bradley making moves like that inside? Come on, man, let's go, come on. Jamal, corner, catch and shoot, boom. Nothing but net, 17 to seven. We got about 55 seconds to go. He's in, jeez. I mean, that's just too easy. I don't know how to stop that one. All right, they're definitely gonna hit double digits. <laughs> There's no doubt about it. So we gotta keep burying our shots. The truth answers with a boom. Come on, come on, oh, jeez. How about a steal, how about a steal? Just one, just one? Who's that, Kelly Olnick? No, come on. All right, he's got a 97 midi. All right, all right. <laughs> I told you they were gonna get double digits. Jamal off the pierce screen, buries it from the wing. Buries it from the wing. I told you these guys were buckets. I told you. Now they're just wasting all kinds of time until they score. Watch. <laughs> Gosh darn it. All right, well, um, we need to get up by more than 10, that's for sure. This is kind of disappointing. Come on, Jamal, can we get him over? Oh boy, this is right on the nose. Buzzer beater, Jamal Crawford from the near wing. These guys just scored 26 points. The team gave up 13, or rather, I gave up 13 
It's a very easy W for a couple of buckets out there. Okay, so, you know, we got a lot of content right now. We've got this game time D Rose OOP out of position at center. And he is definitely a center build, not a D Rose build. Um, I think this could be a little bit controversial. Some people may like it who just love OOP cards. I'm pretty much on the fence about it. And then obviously we've got our playoff promo. We got four cards here with position boosts. And then the Grandmaster is Joel Embiid with a plus four defense position boost. And then today I was a little surprised really this one dropped right here, Endurance Masters. Uh, not super impressed with the builds on the 94s, but the Grandmaster is a 96 style select. Carl Malone, and he has a plus two inside scoring boost to team. But we'll talk about these cards when we do a video on them. We'll talk about these cards when we do a video on them. But for today, it's my new shooting guard and my new small forward, and I think you just saw why in that gameplay. Jamal Crawford, always one of my favorite cards, whether he's a point guard or shooting guard, and Paul Pierce with that plus four elite shooting boosted team. That is a biggie. So good luck guys with all these promos, and with that, it's over, it's done, we're out of here. <laughs> and there's no more. And remember, peace out.